What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today's video we're focusing on the Rugby Championship and Australia's plan to host the tournament. Now we heard earlier in the year that this was the goal for Australia to do it as uh, creating a tournament in one spot, one destination to avoid traveling abroad overseas as a lot of the nations are still under strict lockdown rules besides obviously New Zealand and Australia who are progressing but South Africa is still in uh, got their restrictions and Argentina as we know as well so the the head of Australian rugby has decided the interim head has decided to order propose matches being played over in Australia and expanded four test bledders love cup series with the all blacks and his, the goal is to get this going in hopefully September and in order to get things moving now September is a long way away still but it does give us time to hopefully continue reduction of lockdown South Africa yesterday just moved to level um, level three of lockdown from level four so hopefully if we continue moving in the way we're going, unfortunately we're not reducing with the number of infections and deaths like what we see in New Zealand, but we are reducing the lockdown. And if our players can are allowed to escape to travel abroad, then we can definitely see this tournament kicking off um, in September. And I really hope that it goes well. Obviously the importance is safeguarding the future of the wallabies because this is going to give them a good boost now new zealand apparently could be moving to level one lockdown in june meaning that they could maybe invite fans back to the stadiums which will give it a boost if australia can at least head into those directions as well it means that they will be able to fund and get more money into the union which is very much needed especially in the stadiums going forward as they are at a major debt loss so these are all positive contributors to Rugby Australia and to having the sport back in general. And I'm not really fussy as to where it's going to be because I just want to see international rugby at its highest. And if it's in Australia, it's in Australia. But if I can see South Africa play the All Blacks, the Aussies, as well as Argentina in one venue, give it to me. I am happy. So we'll have to wait and see, obviously, approvals, but Rugby Australia are talking to New Zealand, are talking to South Africa, are talking to Argentina in order to propose something to go ahead and whether they can fly all these teams over and have a meeting in order to progress this going forward. I think it's a great move forward. I think it's, it's something we need to go on. Um, but uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens. Obviously, with Australia um, reducing their, their staff big time and, and uh, trying to find ways to save money, this will be a massive boost to the nation in order to produce and increase income. So I, I'm all for it, and I think it will be great for Rugby Australia and it will be great for rugby in general because the Rugby Championship and Bledders Love Cup need to go ahead. And uh, what a boost it will be if we can see it still happening this year, and better yet, in September. But we'll need to talk to the big bosses and hope that the lockdown ruling of COVID-19 pandemic continues to reduce. Otherwise, they might as well just continue it with Australia and New Zealand because South Africa are still stuck in South Africa. But until then, these are positive outcomes. It's all good news that we are hearing that progress is being made and that things are being implemented in order to create a format of international rugby and a rugby championship and a players love cup so i'm happy i'm smiling and i'm feeling positive about all these outcomes coming forward let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below obviously i'm sure we all can agree we hope to see this coming back uh, very soon but we'll have to wait and see until that eventually happens that's going to do it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and i'll see you real soon for another one stay safe and never give up cheers